Hello and welcome to episode 24 of my Folktale Tutorial Let's Play series. This episode will be on continuing the Mor Mordridge quest chain and uh, continuing on from where we left off in the last episode, which was doing the quest Seizing the Everlight. So let's continue on and see if we can do this. Here is the boss. By your leave. Who happens Outsider, to be please. Willow? You can't take the Everlight. Without it, decay and corruption will consume the glade, our home. And for what? So Mordred can make more sandals? Okay, I shall take the Everlight. Your question should be whether or not you die trying then to I stop me. I shall take no pleasure from your death, but you must be stopped. Rise up, sisters of the glade. Defend our home. Oh, that don't sound good. Sounds like she's going to raise an army. Now, the space bar is so handy. So, what I want to do is just get them all Something needs to take out Willow first. Because she is obviously to the toughest. And what I can also do is select their skills. But I shan't. I should have stay on quicks. But you can go through doing their skills and everything. Oops, I meant to do tall. Okay, quicks went down rather quickly, so I'm going to have to do the heal potions. That's it, bring some skellies into the mix. No, wait a minute, Willow's not taking any damage. I'm... She is starting to get hurt, but not much. I'm going to have to retreat. And try this again. So I'm going to try taking out uh, her followers next time. Just waiting for Quicks to get back. Come on, Quicks. If only he was. So, yeah, she is tough. But she's only level 5. Same level as my heroes. Is he not coming back? Okay. At once! These are back to full health, so we will try again. That's better. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, except she just done a full heal on herself. Yeah, she's healing herself. Look at that. How cool is that? You gotta love that. Come on, Sir Gregory. You can do it. my home, murdered my people, and destroyed our entire way of life. I weep for your soul, outsider. And there we go. It's about time. I was getting tired of stop destroying our land and exploiting our resources. Boo-hoo! A pity she didn't leave behind a corpse. She would have made a great zombie. We should report our success to Mordred. He'll be more than pleased to hear that snot-nosed hippie is Okay, so there we go. Quix is back with us, fortunately. Uh, time to head back and report our success. It's something very noisy over there. Okay, let's go through this teleport.
and now we're going to head back to his crypt which is all the way over here and then I've got to give the Everlight to Mordridge Something I can't remember whether I did was uh, when I'd killed Mossclaw, he actually dropped some really nice items, and I think I'd have lost that by now. Um, but uh, when you kill Mossclaw, make sure you remember to loot, because he dropped some really nice items, which I believe I've lost now, because I didn't remember. Yeah, he died somewhere over here, but probably he's long gone that by now. You only get so long to loot before the corpses disappear. Okay, let's go report to Mordridge. So remember, once I've done the evil uh, quest chain, I'm then going to do the Glade Folks quest chain, just so you can see the different quest chains and also the different heroes that you get. So for the evil, you get Lilith. But I believe I'd prefer to have Willow. Especially as she can heal Sir Gregory in Quicks. That would be totally awesome. A job well done, mortal. With this we can expand our operations to include not just sandals, but a whole line of affordable footwear. Villagers everywhere will be able to appreciate the comfort and savings of Mordred brand sandals, shoes, boots, and more. This is a great day for enterprising individuals such as myself. It's clear that you and Lilith work quite well together. So, being the generous soul that I am, I've decided to release her from the bonds of my employment directly into yours. You're welcome. What? No! What about Brom? I won't leave him! Stop being so dramatic. You can come visit him in between your adventures with Meatbag here. Speaking of adventures, I have one final task to ask of you, mortal. While the complete and utter decimation of the Glade has given me great joy, their leader, Nora, still remains. I fear that while she still draws breath, the free market remains in danger. Defeat Nora, and we will finally have the industrial utopia we've always dreamed of. Okay, so as you can see, I get to keep Lilith now. And, oh, what's this? Oh, it's locked. I wonder if I'll get the key to that. Oh, there's another law book over there. Let's have a quick look. What's this law book? Mordred's Journal, first day. Third moon of winter. The moaning. Oh goodness, the constant moaning. Make it stop. Of course they failed to mention that in the job interview. Time to write a strongly worded letter and ask for a transfer. I knew I should have applied for the spirit plane job. So there we go, a bit of Mordrich humour over there. Oh, what? oh, so I did get experience from reading the journal. Oh, I'm definitely going to have to hunt out the rest of them now. I didn't realise that. Oh, and there's a chest I didn't see. Oh, look at that. Lesser goo potion. Well, I don't know what that's for. But I will loot it. Yeah, I missed these chests before. Is that any good? Mount Sir Gregory. Well, I think that's all the chests. I wonder if there's any more loot. Let's have a quick search around Mordridge is crypt or castle, whatever you want to call this, manor. Oh, here we go. So let's see if they all get experience again. Oh no, it didn't look like they did. It's quite 
big this place. Ooh, is that more chests to loot? I believe it is. What's that? Worn by Gideon's grandmother signifies enduring love. And it's a blue item. Well, I shall loot it. I'm not sure it's at any point. 20 physical damage. Let's check Sir Gregory. Double the damage. Oh yeah. I'm so gonna take that. Okay, so let's open up Sir Gregory's bag. Let's open up the main bag of my settlement and find that lovely sword. Very nice. Uh, so it's definitely worth hunting around and searching all the chests because you'll be rewarded with a nice upgrade like this. Uh, and there we go. He's now going to do double the damage. Very, very nice. What else have I got? Cloth cap, currently equipped. Oh no, so he's got better equipped. That's one better. Not sure it's going to make a great much difference. Oh, belt of lesser poison resistance. Uh, Lilith and Quicks, three to strength. I think I'll give them four poison. I think I'll give that to Quicks because he's the one who dies. So let's open up. Oops, I did have it open. Let's give him that. Yeah, I've not gone through all the items I've been looting, so I think it's time I did. There we go. Hopefully that will benefit Quicks. Make him live a little longer. Wow, 46. What's the Gregory shield on? Oh, 46. That's the same. Um, any other upgrades? No, it's the same. Free physical damage. I think you're having a laugh with that one. Oh, what's this? Cunning chainmail. 20 armor. Yeah, this is an upgrade. Free agility. Oh, that's got to go to Quicks. Because that is Quicks' primary stat, which should put that on 10. So, yeah. Oh, except Quicks can't use it. Ugh. So let's check Sir Gregory. What a shame. Mind you, having said that, uh, what was the item I just gave to Quicks? Was it this belt? Free strength. The strength is the primary attribute for Sir Gregory, so I need to give that to Sir Gregory. Yeah. Um, is there a better belt I can give to Quicks? No. And so I'm going to give that to Sir Gregory because that should boost his strength. Oh no, his strength. His primary attribute is vitality. So forget that. Let's give him it back. Ten armor. That's better. Then what is. Can he wear that? Yep. Yeah. Um, oh, there's the timer. I will go on a bit longer though, um, because I'm trying to sort their armors out, which is something I should have done a long, long time ago, but never mind. I'm just looking to see if there's any more magical items I've picked up, because they seem to be very... I don't know what all the jewellery is for. It doesn't seem to be... I expect that's for a future update. Ah, who's this usable by? Sir Gregory. So let's give him that. Because currently 
Yeah, that'd be much better. Okay, I think that's enough for now. I'll ch have to check the rest off camera. Right, okay, let's head back and defeat Nara. Or let's continue to see if there's any more treasure chests around here. And I'll get to Nara in the next episode. No, there's nothing in there. Let's have a look up here. Oh, here's another room. Oh look, there's little pots as well. Yeah, I'm sure jewellery must get some use in a later update. Ooh, it's free chests here. Forty six armor oh no, it's the same as what I've got. Well, I'm not sure if I'll be able to sell that stuff in the future. But I'll grab it for now. Okay, let's have a look. Anywhere else for me to map out? Yeah. I haven't, I haven't done over here yet. Let's have a quick look over here. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Must have got dust in the air. I know some of you are one, uh, might be wondering if this is all worth searching out, so I thought, why not? And let's show you what items can be found. I'm not sure if it will be the same items you will find. But for the law books, it will be the same. No, it doesn't seem to be any... Oh, I say that, but then here we go. Oh, just a bit of gold. Okay, let's go out of here. Oh, more chests in here. Oh, and another book. I mean, the um, city watch can use it, and the cavalry. I must make some cavalry, actually. They've been implemented now, I believe, with the last update. Let's see what this book is. Unholy Leggings. Ooh, I wonder if um, we'll be able to make this. I'll have to check. Oh, look at that. Tailoring recipe unlocked. How cool is that? So it's definitely worth clicking on all the lore books, which I haven't been doing, um, because you can get experience or you can get recipes. So that sounds like that's going to be something good for Lilith. I really am going to have to start checking everything much more thoroughly now. And I do mean everything. Wow, that's really cool. I didn't realise you can get recipes through the books. Okay, is that this all done now? Yeah, that's Mordred's room. Okay, let's exit out and I'll end the episode from outside. And in the next episode, we will do Snuffing the Light. So, well worth your hunting around Mordredge's lair. 
because not only will you get experience from the books, you'll also get that recipe to be able to make them leggings for Lilith. So well worth your time and effort of searching out Mordridge's place. Wherever you are in the world, God bless you and keep every last one of you safe. Thank you for watching and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.